In this video, we're gonna do a drill called in and out volleys. This is a great way to work on your hand speed. It's also a great way to work on making sure that you're contacting the ball in your strike zone, which sometimes means you have to wait just a little bit. Let's go! <laughs> to begin this drill, we start with our partner straight across from us. We're each going to take a step inside the no volley zone. Just to clarify, you can't be volleying in here in a real match, but for this drill, we're going to stand inside the no volley zone. The reason we're doing that is because we can still hit balls in a controlled manner, but they're coming to us sooner, so it's helping us work on our hand speed. Imagine a big rectangle in front of your partner. This is the area that you want to be hitting the ball to. This is a drill that's about keeping this under control. Our contact point is out in front. Our weight is in the balls of our feet. We extend slightly forward, doing our best to keep this ball in control back and forth. The next part of this drill, your partner and you will both take a step outside the no volley zone and stand about three to four inches behind the line. We're still aiming for that nice big rectangle in front of our partner. Here we go. Now this ball is taking longer to get to us. We have to practice waiting for it to get into our ideal strike zone, which is a foot in front of our body. Notice as we're waiting for the ball to come back to us, our paddle is out in front. Our arms are not falling in towards our body. Everything's out in front, contact point out in front. Our weight is soft, we're not locked in. We're allowing our weight to shift back and forth. I hope you can take the information that you've gotten from this video and apply it to your play so that I can be a part of helping you grow your game.